hello lovely people you're welcome back again to my youtube channel my name is chica judith in today's video i'm going to be talking about the six best places to live in Umar here abia state nigeria so if this is the kind of video you'd love to see don't go anywhere i'll be right back you're welcome back lovely so permit me to say that Umar here is one of the coolest and calmest city you would ever find here in nigeria yeah i live here so i know what i am talking about in fact that's one of the reasons i love this place i don't like noisy places okay it's a very cool and calm um city and if you actually live in a very noisy place a very noisy location outside of umahe and waba or abia state generally and you're looking for a chill place a calm place to live in umahe is the sure place for you yeah but if you're already here and you feel okay you've been in a quiet zoom for too long and you just need to feel that noisy vibe like that you know what i mean that lagos vibe you know just go to ishigate here in umaya yes <laughs> that's where everything all the noise is happening in umaya <laughs> unfortunately we don't have the best of roads i must confess we don't have the best of roads here in umaya with the new government everything will be sorted out i mean our government is already working go to Aba and yeah you will see things for yourself so i know that with time the bad road story will be over like we'll not be talking about bad roads again here in umaya by his grace yes so there are actually places in umaya that you could live in that have that have fair roads like their roads are not really that bad places like azikiwe road bca secretariat roads all those areas have roads that are not so, so bad <laughs> if you're actually considering coming into my hair and you don't know the places to live in i am going to be suggesting these six places and the first is ahimiri housing ahimiri housing is located along umudike ikote pene road the place is quite secure because there is a police headquarter around that area that's their zone 9 so it's quite secured even though the best security is god okay the best security you could ever rely on is god actually yes so yeah then when it comes to power supply the power supply there is fair enough i am not promising a 24 hour power supply but most of the times there is usually light in that area there are actually good schools in that area too very good schools in that area yeah and streams of joy is actually located very close to that place so you have your schools churches not just streams of joy security power supply so the place is actually okay even though bad road is always the challenge but i'm not going to be talking about that because i've said that previously in this video next up is umobe housing umobe housing is located in Oloko Uma here abia state nigeria and when it comes to security the place is quite secure and when it comes to power supply the power supply in Umobe housing is fair enough at least you could monitor observe and work with the time like they have the particular time that they bring their light so if you have things to keep in the fridge you know when they are bringing the light you know when you, you are expecting to see light and you know when you are not expected or expecting to see light okay so when it comes to power supply in Umobe housing it is fair enough they also have a market although it's not located in Umobe actually but in Olokoro the general market known as Ayuku market so if you want to shop for your food stocks you could actually go there and buy your food stocks next up yeah. is Locust Housing Locust Housing is very close to World Bank Housing Abama Housing and is also secured when it comes to power supply the power supply is fair enough yes i'm not promising a 24 hour power supply in that area also okay it's fair enough and they also have this market that you could shop your food stuff items whenever you want to world bank housing estate to my hair that place is actually chilled it's mm -hmm. calm when it comes to security they are okay when it comes to power supply they are fair enough okay. the last but not the least is abama housing abama housing is also very close to world bank it's also very close to low cost and the place is also calm the place is also very okay even though they don't have the best of roads yes but the, when it comes to power supply they are fair enough in fact i i believe that world bank low cost and some part of abama i'm not sure of all the parts in abama house they share same source of power like if there is light in low cost there's also light in world bank there's also light in abama housing okay so if you are looking for places to live in umahia these are the places that 
you will live in and you will not have much of a problem so if this video has helped you please kindly give it a thumbs up and share me out if you can subscribe to my channel if you haven't i'll see you in my next video bye